welcome back to Savvy Charmed Life. Um, if you haven't been here before, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. I'm Tracy, and today I'm going to do kind of a little mini haul. It's just from three different sticker companies, and um, the sticker sheets are small, but there's a lot to them. So, we'll start with my Kina Prince order. Um, so with my order, I, you know, it takes a while, like wish orders, Kina Prince is coming from, I believe the Philippines. Um, and so it does take a good bit of time for your order to arrive. Um, so sometimes I can't remember what I order from her, um, before it comes. So, um, but I did finally get my order from her. Um, with it, this is just a little card that was in the bag with these, um, die cut stickers um but i'm thinking i'll either put it in my journal as like a little you know remember that i had happy mail from kina prince or maybe i'll find a way to reuse it but it just says kina prince accessories but like everything that she makes it's super cute and i really like it even though it's literally just part of the packaging but i think it's really cute um i also for samplers got this free um die cut little girl that has this little like um rainbow spiral shirt and ruffle skirt she's got blonde hair and i'm really really sure going what's going on with um her hair i can't tell her if those are bows or earmuffs or or is she supposed to be like part of me is like is she supposed to be like a sheep or something and those like i don't know if you guys can help me figure out like what this little die cut girl is, um, go for it in the comment section. Let me know your ideas of what you think she is. Um, and then I also got this little, um, sampler that just has three little fashion girls on it with flower garland in their hair. Um, and they look very serious. Um, so yeah, um, that was the little sampler and a free little die cut. And then I got, she sent along, like I said, that was just the accessory card. Um, and then um, this was another little freebie. Um, I got this um, journal card that I usually use for like bookmarks. Sometimes I put them in my journal as like um, decoration, but she personalized it with my name, which is really sweet. And it just has a little message to her customers as a thank you. Um, but the items that I actually ordered was I ordered a few die cuts. I got this little, I can't remember. She has a name for each of her little characters, but I really like the little princess girl with the pink hair. She's always got this little crown in her hair. So this one says, sorry, I'm not showing you very well. This one says coffee break with a giant coffee mug with a little girl sticking next to it is really cute. And this is the same little girl that says you can do it. And then I went ahead and got um, one of the little Hufflepuff fashion girls. Um, I think each fashion girl for each house has a different color hair. So it's not, I wouldn't, I couldn't have gotten the blonde haired girl for Hufflepuff. Like each house like has a different girl. So the Hufflepuff house girl has this like brownish red, maybe like auburn colored hair and light skin. Um, so that's the Hufflepuff girl. So those are the three die cuts that I got. You can do it, Hufflepuff fashion girl and coffee break. And I can't remember if these are sticker. Yeah, they are. These are sticker die cuts. Okay. All right. And then I got a bunch of little mini sheets. So I got some food ones. I needed some more pizza um, stickers. So I got a sheet of the pizza ones and then I got two sheets of these um, scripts that say meals, hydrate, workout, medicine, vitamins, checkup, and steps. Um, and I got two sheets of that. And then I got this girl who is putting on makeup and I got two makeup girls because I thought since, I don't know about you guys, but since um, the pandemic started um, and going so long with shelter in place and not wearing makeup, I find that I don't feel it's necessary. Like I got used to seeing myself without makeup and suddenly I'm like, I don't know if it's my age or what, but I'm not afraid to leave the house without makeup anymore. Like I'm okay being natural, but then some days it's like, it's more like 
special. It's like a special occasion to put on makeup now. Um, so I got two little makeup girls. And like I said, I can't remember the names. She has names for all of these little character girls. But this is the little dark haired girl. Um, and so she's just like sitting at like a, a dresser or something with her mirror and her little makeup. And then this one is like the brown haired girl with a little bow in her hair. Um, and she's putting powder on and looking at herself in a mirror. So I got two little makeup girls. Um, this one says online class, which I felt like was fitting. I'm still doing some virtual lessons with kids. So I thought that would be appropriate. And then this one um, is cheat day. Me and my husband uh, gave up sugar like years ago. Um, and we um, normally, I say gave up sugar. We don't let ourselves have sugar Monday through Friday, and then we let ourselves have a cheat on the weekends. But every once in a while, if we've had like a crazy bad day or something really stressful is going on, we'll let ourselves have a cheat day. So I feel like these were appropriate. And then also I am trying to eat better. So, you know, if I give myself, let myself have a hamburger, that would definitely be a cheat day. And I got these little pancake day ones. Um, if I ever make pancakes or maybe we go out to eat to get pancakes and then I thought these little mermaid girls were super cute. This little mermaid has green hair with this little star in her, in her hair. So really cute, um, mermaid girl. So those are all the little sticker sheets that I got from Kina Prince. So her sticker sheets are usually like a dollar, but they are small. Um, but like with the pizza ones, for instance, you get, what is this? Four by one, two, three eight, nine, four by nine. What is that? Two times nine is 18. Is that 36? Is four times nine 36? I don't know, math is hard. Uh, but you do get a good bit of them on the little mini sheets. So she usually, and then sometimes she'll have some like discounts or sales um, where you can get them even cheaper, cheaper than a dollar. Um, but I really like Kina Prince. I'll put a link down below. I'm not an affiliate of her. This is not sponsored. Um, I just like her stickers. I think they're really cute. All right. And then I also got, finally, my order from Hello Petite. Another order that takes a while. Hello Petite. Um, it's Hello Petite paper, right? Yeah, Hello Petite paper is based in Portugal, I believe. So it also takes quite a while for your order to get to you if you live um, I'm not sure how it would be if you lived in Europe or England, but um, in the States, it takes a while to get an order from Hello Petite. So I did get this little, um, she, everything from Hello Petite is just beautiful. Like it's just really pretty and elegant and, and um, I don't know how to put it, delicate, you know, just really pretty, excuse me, really pretty. So I got this little card. Um, a little, uh, uni uh, I guess a journal card, like a little mini journal card and it has a pink bow, but it also has foil on it. It's so pretty. So this was a freebie. And then I also got this as a freebie, bonjour. I thought that was really pretty. Um, so it has like a little, um, pretty like bicycle, the kind of bicycle you'd expect to see in Paris on one side with bonjour. And then you have, um, which I know me and my Southern accent saying bonjour is like, sounds horrible. So if you know French or from France or anywhere in Canada that speaks French and I just insulted you, I apologize with my horrible accent um, and pronunciation. I actually took three years of French in high school, French one, two, and three in high school and two semesters in college. And all I remember how to say is je m'appelle Tracy, um, je ne comprends pas, je ne sais pas, and bonjour, and that's about it. And honest, honestly, probably my um, pronunciation is bad. So basically I remember how to say my name, um, hello, my name is, <laughs> and, or I think, je, I think je m'appelle is just, my name is um so i don't my i know how to say hello my name is tracy and i don't understand i can't remember je ne com oh, yeah, i think je ne comprends pas is i either i don't understand or do not comprehend and then je ne sais pas i think it's just i don't know so that's all i remember in french yay me um after the equivalent of what like five years of french <laughs> that's all i remember oh and i can count to 20 
yay. Um, but on one side you have bonjour and then on the back you have um, this kind of like fashion kind of scene. So like a shirt on a, on a, um, why is my brain, I'm filming this late at night on a Sunday so my brain is probably shutting down on me which is probably also why I'm rambling with you guys. A hanger, a little shirt hanging on a hanger. It might be a dress, I can't tell. Some macaroons, like a whole plate of them, sunglasses, a bag, I think, shoes. So maybe like a French fashion girl. So a really cute card. The whole other part about this is I'm definitely gonna have to put it in something see-through, like laminated or clear where you can see it on both sides when I put it in something. Because I wouldn't wanna like glue it down and have to choose between one side or the other, or maybe use removable tape or something. And then this is the little sampler, um, which I can definitely use these because not every kit I get comes with these. And I like to track what meals we have every day with these little trackers, the day of the week tracker. And then these cute little stickers, which I will definitely use like anything from Hello Petite, I love and I'm gonna use. I'm starting to run out of stickers, so. Um, so whenever we go on outings these days, we've been trying to explore our own state as we ease back into travel. Um, I actually is sitting right here because we literally just went um, exploring one of the oldest cemeteries in Georgia today. And I have an Instax Mini um, that I take photographs with. So I thought it would be fitting to have some little Instax you know, uh, Fuji film uh, stickers. And these are really cute. They, there's some of them are solid color and some have floral to them. So that's really pretty. Um, I was starting to run, I had a bunch of her laptops and was starting to run out. So I did get another laptop sticker sheet. Like I said, everything she does is so pretty. And then I went ahead and got some fall stickers that I can't wait to use in my like decoration for like my daily journal pages in my November setup. So just like fall pumpkins and wreaths and a banner. This is fall, really pretty. Here's another fall sheet that I got, just decorative sheet with some floral pumpkins and mugs and journals and banners and stuff like that. So just beautiful fall colors. And then I got, this is just general floral that I could really use any time of year. So just different flower pots and waves. Sorry, I had a call come in that like cut off my camera. Okay, um, and then just some more work ones. I have a set of these already that are a different style, but this one is really pretty. Like it's like galaxy, it's so pretty. Yeah, so Study Time Constellation is the name of this sticker sheet. So it has like a stack of books with coffee mugs, some more laptops, a book with a coffee mug, a stack of book with glasses, some little, you know, a stack of paper and pencil with glasses and the laptops with mugs. So I just, you know, some working stickers. And then I got two um, uh, date cover and date dot um, kits. So they ha you have two weeks and then a full month of date dots that are hard. So I got this gray, like sparkly kind of one. And then this like teal seafoam green kind of one. And it has like faux foil, you know, ask, you know, it's got like gold accent to it, but it's not actually gold foil. It's just, you know, matte drawn on. Um, and then I did get some more working girl, like not working girl, working stickers, but these are fall specific. So we have some pens with pumpkins on them. Um, fall color little um, decorative paper clips, planner clips, um, laptops with a pumpkin on them. Basically the same as this one, but instead of constellation themed, this one is fall themed. So same stack of books with glasses, paper with glasses and laptops, but they all have little pumpkins and fall colors to them. So really cute. And then one more fall sheet that has pumpkins and flowers and everything. So I can't wait to use these to help me decorate, like I said, my November like daily journal pages in my planner. So love everything Hello Petite. Just love everything Hello Petite. And then the last little thing I wanna show you, somebody that I follow on Instagram, and I can't remember who it is, got an order from Lola's Craft Journal and I thought it was so pretty. So she has these hand-drawn 
um, die cuts that she creates and she sent this little card that I can't wait to put in my planner and it just says hi Tracy thank you so much for your purchase I hope you like the stickers and also hope my art fills you with magic and cozy feelings oh Lola XX that is so sweet I'm gonna have to take a picture of this and like put this also in my journal so I don't forget because that's really sweet and I just think this card is so beautiful I'm trying to decide whether just to slap it on the particular page for where I you know document happy mail or if I should save it for something else because it's just so pretty I also don't want to cut it up either but maybe cut this and reuse this for a, a spread someday I don't know but the little stickers and this little they're not stickers I think they're just die cuts so if I stick them on somewhere, and these are the kinds of ones that are just so pretty, you don't want to use them, you know? This was the freebie that came with it. So just this little, you know, um, what do you call that? Like a little branch of leaves. Um, I think there's another word for that, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Just black and white, but really pretty and delicate. And then these are the three that I ordered. So I got this badger one, which I thought was appropriate for Hufflepuff. So the badger is just like sitting on this log underneath a big um, mushroom. Also it gives me Alice in Wonderland kind of vibes. Um, I don't know if you guys are feeling that too, but obviously the badger. Oh, and I think this is a freebie too. I think I only ordered two die cuts. I'd have to look it up because I don't remember ordering this. But this is just a little sweater, which is perfect again for fall and winter. Very cozy. So I'm pretty sure these are the two that I ordered. So the badger, I think I ordered two badgers. So, and this one is a little badger in like a pumpkin house and it says stay cozy on it. Oh, like I said, Definitely got the badgers because hello, Hufflepuff, you guys. If you're new here, I am definitely Hufflepuff House, Hufflepuff Pride. Um, so I got the badgers specifically because I'm a Hufflepuff, but they also are very fall. Like I said, this one's definitely giving me awesome Wonderland vibes, and this one's just very fall and magic, and uh, I just love it. Definitely love it. Um, so yeah, these are just hand-drawn little art pieces that she puts into die cuts. Oh. So I just fell in love. I saw them on Instagram and I fell in love and like, you know, went to her page and checked out her Etsy shop and ordered these right away. Um, so I just think they are beautiful and I'm sure you agree. <sighs> so yeah, that just makes me so happy. Okay, so those are the three orders that I got in the mail today. Lots of happy mail that I've been waiting on. I think this order took a while too. Lots of happy mail that I've been waiting on for quite a while, right? So my Kina Prince order, my Hello Petite order, and my um, Lola's Craft Journal order. None of these are sponsored or affiliates, but I will link everything below. If it is an Etsy link, which this one and this one are gonna be Etsy links, um, that is, I am an affiliate of Etsy. So I do get a small commission for many purchases you make through that link. It's no additional cost to you. It's just um, Etsy pays me a small commission if you make any purchases through the Etsy links. Um, the Etsy links are short links that have tiddly in the line, so that's how you know um, that it's an Etsy affiliate link. Um, but I'm not an affiliate of these particular companies. I just love them. Um, so if you do make purchases through this Etsy links, um, thank you for supporting me and my channel. Um, the Kina Prints is just a, her regular website and I'm not an affiliate or will, will not make any money whatsoever through this link. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. Normally when I make orders through Hello Petite or Kina, I usually wait until I need more from their shop and then order a lot. So I try to order like, I can't remember, maybe at least 10 sheets. I can't remember how many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I think I ordered 10. I try to order at least 10 so that 
the amount of time you have to wait and then the amount you pay for shipping and everything that it makes it worth it um the order um the same thing with kina like when i make sure that i when i place an order the amount of time i have to wait for it and everything and pay for her to ship it and everything from a faraway country um that i'm getting everything that i want from that shop um that i can afford obviously um to make the order worthwhile and worth it for me um so thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments section which of these three orders or sticker sheets in particular, um, if you want to be that specific, was your favorite in today's haul. I would love to know. Um, and I can't wait to see, you. oh, of course, if you love sticker hauls, please hit that like button. I would be so grateful if you did. And if you just love stickers, if you love planners, if you love all things stationary, if you love bullet journals, then I would love to welcome you to this Savvy Charmed Life family. Then please hit that subscribe button as well. All right, now I can finally close this out. I can't wait to see you guys next time. All right, bye.